Congratulations, you have successfully signed up uh, with an account with Parent Reading Coach. This tutorial is going to show you how to add a student and then manage the student data. <clears throat> the first thing you really want to know is at what particular level you should add the student to the system so that they start at the appropriate level. Under instructions, we have listed um, the levels in tutorial and given you a level description. Uh, most importantly is sort of this assessment and placement level guide that you can use to determine at what level you should start the, the student. Here are some written district descriptions about how to also manage the system. Let's go back in. So the first step you need to do is to sign in. So as a parent, you sign in and put your user, your uh, email, your username, and then the password you created. And you sign in. Um, in my system, I already have three kids in here, but let's say I want to add a student. So I go to student management and I need to add the student I want. So I say add new kid. I'm going to call my kid uh, Frank Torres. Um, put his first name as Frank. Let's say he is eight years old. Boy, and I create a password. One, two, three, four, five, six. Something easy to remember. One, two, three, four, five, six, just to confirm the password, and I say add. Now I have Frank in my system. Now to add his particular level, um, I will go to this eyeball, and I will be able to say update level. So let's determine that I, you know, thought that, you know, after looking at that, I said Frank is on level three, um, and he is on flow two, and I will update it. And it's important to know this because you may have, you may determine that you want to. Um, have your child or your student repeat a particular system that leads to or towards mastery. So now if I go back to student management, Frank's all set. Um, <clears throat> one thing to re remember while we're here is once a student completes a level, um, we have created these master assessments for you. So when Frank completes level three, um, he had gone through the whole program, you know, we've provided you an option to download the master assessment, which is the pencil to paper component of that. And then you can use these sheets to go through it so you don't have to be constantly monitoring his progress on this. And then you have uh, additional practice exercises within here. And if you determine that uh, he or she has mastered it, then you just move on. But if he has not, you may reset the level to go back to, to so that they practice it again. But we've added Frank, so let's log out. And then let's log in as Frank. So if you notice I log in as Frank, I go to the student login and I will print Frank's uh, uh, username and password and I will sign in. And it automatically starts him at level three. So again, you know, when I get to level three, you'll notice at the top there's a listening card. Always starts in the system. It's a progressive, so they have to listen to it first. Then they'll eventually get to mastery, then they get to spelling, and they'll get this master assessment, which basically has the student calling you to make sure that they can are ready to move on to the next level. Um, and one one final thing, if, if you uh, want to understand how the system works, we've also included these video tutorials, so you can always go in here and watch an understanding of how this level on competency with learning how to read is there so you have an understanding when you do that mastery. So one additional thing we want to show you, very few if any um, early literacy reading books that allow a students to build upon previous skill sets and learn how to read. Most of the easy to read books that you may find in many of the bookstores um, usually have a comp, uh, they aren't con con controlled vocabulary and they don't necessarily follow a systematic approach leading to frustration in students. So we've also, um, we also recommend that you actually go and purchase some of the books that we've created that follow the system and complement this particular program. Um, you can always buy them on Amazon, just Amazon.com, and I always type in Learn to Read Phonetically, and the books will just pop up. Alternatively, you can just go to Parent Reading Coach, and we have <clears throat> the books listed here. So if you go to the, you know, the side panel, then you can actually talk about the books and manuals. Always buy <clears throat> the collections one through six, six here, or and soon to be seven through twelve at a discounted rate. We also have other services here. You can always buy the printed uh, manuals here if you want to take a deep dive into how the program works. And then, of course, we have you know additional services if you need consultation or tutoring for your particular child or student. Um, welcome to Parent Reading Coach, and we wish you luck with the program.